the house in the plantation started off sort of tragically to begin with, didn't it? Yes. Hardy Brian Croom, who began the construction of the house, was, and all of his children and wife were drowned at sea coming here from uh, New England uh, to move into the house, uh, to complete the house. Uh, they were drowned in a hurricane uh, off the coast of uh, South Carolina, Cape Hatteras. They all perished at the same time. Moving to the uh, front living room, uh, front parlor, I believe it's called, right? Well, let's uh, let's give a general description of the of the house itself. It's square. Uh, it's a classic uh, type of uh, Georgian architecture, which consisted in those generally of the front and a back parlor, mm -hmm. and then uh, uh, a dining room and either a music room or a library on the first floor. Now, the front parlor, you asked about what uh, what particularly was. Well, the architecture in itself is very striking. Uh, yes, well, this is, a, this is a general construction of, of, of houses at, at that particular time. Uh, what was the use of a front and a well, front? Well, now, the, the, <laughs> the front parlor was usually closed off and was extremely formal. and was generally only used for funerals and, and uh, weddings. And uh, sliding doors which separated the front and the back parlor were usually kept closed. 